Yeah, uh, morning everyone. I just want to do a quick video. Um, I'm just out for my morning a bit of exercise and that brisk walk and I thought I'd stop and do a quick video, keep the channel going. And uh, it's called The Gold because um, it's about gold. Uh, yeah, so we're going back to the 90s, early 90s, mid 90s. Uh, yeah, so what I used to do with all the gold that I used to get, yeah, and we know how I used to get it, and I did used to get a lot. You know, uh, gold back then um, was about, on 24 carat, was about 25 a gram. You know, it's about 67 now, 65 now. So it's it's triple the price it was then, and I used to have kilos of it. So my day would be, if I was going to weigh my gold in, I'd bag it up, you know, and uh, whatever bag I had hold or carry a bag, and then drive up or walk up to two in to Amen Corner to a shop where I used to go to there all the time and they'd weigh the gold up or if there was diamonds they check the points on the diamonds if they were any good they might give us some money for the diamonds if not uh, I'd take them back you know the gold uh, the gold would all be melted down and uh, in a smelter and then made into chains or whatever else. I did used to sell some stuff as, as pieces, you know, to, to private buyers and stuff, like certain jewellery and watches and that, you know, but I did used to have a load of gold watches, and a lot of the time, when I used to take them to the shop, uh, they'd smash them with a hammer to show me that they weren't using, uh, going to sell it on as a piece, you know, because sometimes I'd think they weren't giving me the right value. So in today's money, yeah, a kilo of gold would be about, if it was 24 carat, would be about 60 grand. Sorry. Uh, yeah, about 60 grand a kilo. So back then it was about 20 grand a kilo, you know, and uh, it was all different prices. I used to get nine carat, which was about, oh, up to 10 pound a gram, a bit less than that, you know, and then you had 22 carat would be about 18, 19 pound a gram. Also used to get 14 carat, all sorts. Sometimes I even had gold that wasn't ramped up at all, wasn't hallmarked, you know, and I used to have to, that used to be tested. You'd get these chemicals to test if it was proper gold and stuff, you know. So yeah, uh, one time I did get arrested when I was going to sell some gold you know, and uh, there was a stake out outside the shop, you know, and these shops, they have double doors, you know, uh, you have to go through one door and then another door, you know, like security doors. So I was trying to get in the shop and the doors wouldn't open and the police uh, were outside, regional crime squad were outside. This was in Wimbledon. Yeah, so I got arrested, but uh, I, they only done me for, I could only be charged with handling and, uh, yeah, I think that went to court. I can't remember what the sentence was for that, but I was out on bail, you know, uh, yeah. So in today's money, you know, you're looking a few million that I would have done in gold, that I sold in gold, you know. And when I say a few million, I'm talking about over a few years, not all in once, but all at once, you know. And uh, yeah, all that money was mine, 100% profit. Yeah, because there was no investment. Anyway, just a quick one there, guys, about the gold and stuff, and, uh, yeah, just want to get a quick video done, and uh, I've got new tech now, so I hope these videos are a bit clearer and sound a bit better, yeah, but uh, hopefully I'll be up soon, hope everyone's well, and um, I'll speak to you all soon, guys, thank you.